here's an idea. Very few people in this world pick on people they think are going to beat the crap out of them. They're going to make sure they have some advantage. They're going to make sure that they think through size or strength <coughs> or subterfuge that they can take you out. And they will also they want to see what's your behavior going to be. Are you someone who's going to give it back to them? Are you someone who's going to bring, bring it on to them? So they're going to make sure that they pick the right person. So one way of picking the right person is to go in and invade their space and maybe push them a little bit and just get a sense of what they're like. So if John comes in and pushes me and, he, and I kind of back off and I kind of show kind of victim type body language. So what, what am I telling him about myself now? That you're a victim. That I'm a victim, that he's got a good guy, yeah? he's, got, he's got the guy he wants, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. Now, he's basically showing off by pulling back, he's kind of going, yeah, I've got, I've got who I want. Now here's the interesting thing, if you had a brain scan, MRI, and you were look at scanning John's brain now, you would actually see an increase in testosterone, which is the <coughs> power aggression drug, simply by engaging in it as a predator, and John being the aggressor, engaging with me as a predator, and me taking up a victim type body language, that actually shows up aggression drugs in, in John's mind. So I'm actually, by backing off, by paying the victim, I'm actually pulling him onto me. I'm actually creating that victim conversation. The other challenge of it is, what if he comes into me and I just stand here? So oftentimes you'll see guys, they'll try to stand up to people, try to stand off, and they'll try to say, yeah, yeah, I, what, what are you gonna do about this, pal? So the question is, is this a good strategy or not? What do you guys think? No. Yeah, some people sometimes think it's a good strategy because to be honest with you, if you don't know what to do, you kind of might know that backing off is not so hot. So instinctively you know that, but you actually don't know what to do. So you'll try to stand up, to, hoping that by showing you stand up to them, maybe you'll um, deter them. But if this guy is committed to, um, to, to the assault, what's the real problem here? Yeah, the real problem is, if he wants to hit me, I can't stop him. If he wants to hit me, I can't stop him. If I'm from here, he's, uh, I've actually allowed him to take a dominant position. I've allowed him to assume a position where he can take me out and I can do very little about it. We know this is the wrong space, but I'm allowing him to be here. So the question is, what do we do? So this time John's going to walk into my space again. 